I know what you're thinking that we just literally did a navigation review. Why are we talking about navigation again? Also, why are we not in our normal studio setup? This is a weird little vlog style. Well, simply put, my review for navigation, which by the way, if you haven't watched it, check it out. I'll link it in the screen and in the description, was really just over there, like some of their staple pieces. And literally the weekend that I was editing and filming that review, they had a new launch on other pieces that we haven't seen before. And honestly, some of these pieces were really eye-catching. So I did place an order and I just received my package from Navigation. So this is really going to be a true try on haul, first impression, doing it inside my house, not doing it in my studio where I do my official reviews. I don't know how in-depth my commentary will be, but I really wanted to try on some of these new pieces from Navigation and just share my thoughts. You know, just spend some time and hang out with you guys. I feel like usually I'm in such a structured setting, so it's kind of nice and fun doing a vlog style for once. Anyway, I digress. The lighting in here is a little weird, so let's go upstairs to my office to try on some of these pieces. Ah, I'm excited. See you in literally a second. <laughs> let's go. Alright, welcome to my little office space. A little change of scenery, a little lackluster, but that's okay. We're rolling with it. As I said, we got a little nifty package from Navigation. Let's do a little thumbnail moment. Why not? Here we have the pieces. Just a few. Again, this is more of like a casual try on haul, not my normal reviews. I got like six different items in this haul and a lot of it is in their pistachio and lilac color. And then I also got like their digital seamless legging and that's in gray. I'm already seeing this pistachio color is like neon green. I mean, honestly, that's what it looks like on line two. I don't know why I didn't anticipate it being this bright. And then we do have that lilac color, which I'm excited for. I love a good purple. I'm feeling like going all in and starting with a bang. So let's do that pistachio set. We did the lift seamless legging in pistachio as well as the finesse seamless halter bra. So let me throw that on real quick. Suddenly we have a mirror. Alrighty girlies, here is this pistachio fit. And honestly, very obsessed with the color. When I saw it not on my body, I was kind of like, I don't know. It looks a little, a little neon for me. And don't get me wrong, it's still neon, but it's like kind of cute with the tan, you know? Very summer, summer vibes. The leggings are the Lift Seamless leggings and I got this in a size medium. They were $48. And for the top, we have the Finesse Seamless Halter Bra and this was also in a size medium and I got this for $26. So that's one of the things I really like about Navigation is they always keep their prices pretty affordable, but they really have cute aesthetics with their clothes. I will say it might be hard to see in the lighting, but the pistachio color is very, very light. Pretty much like see through. There is ribbing with this sports bra, but you can still see the cup pads a little bit. I know that's a pet peeve for some people, so just keep that in mind with this color. I don't think it's too bad here. It's not giving that mean girls moment where it's just like a circle in the middle. If you know, you know. Of course, this is a halter, so it goes up like a dish. And this is the back, of course, very open back. Great for a back day. I am a 32 double D, so typically I size up in my sports bras. I will say there's so much stretch in this sports bra. Honestly, I almost felt like I could have just gone with a small, but for me, I just wanted to be more safe than sorry. I would say stick with your true size. And if you're in between, unless you have like a huge chest, I would recommend sizing down. Next, we have these lift seamless, very cute. I will do a little 180 as I normally do in my try-ons. My first impression was how the color is so light. So with these leggings right here, you have like this kind of waffle vibe, you know, cute right here. And around the glutes, you have like a super very, very thin, very stretchy material that is the most see-through part of this legging. So when I was pulling this legging up my thigh, putting it on, I noticed that I could see my thigh tattoo right underneath this thinner legging part. And that's the part that's on your glutes here. Just seeing that right off the bat, I knew this is not squat proof whatsoever. So it is pretty see-through. This could just be a upper body day legging. I did size up in this legging and I keep having to like tug different parts of it to make sure the rounded part under here 
here is up where my glute cheeks start. But I sized up because in my last review I did the small. Some of them were just like too small and I didn't like how tight they were in my midsection. Unfortunately, with my glutes not being like the hugest, they don't really fill it out. It's a weird one because my midsection feels totally fine. But the rest of the legging, I feel like it's not structured and thick enough to stay where it needs to be. So even just sizing up kind of adds to that issue. I will say the band here doesn't feel as thick as the other like contour seamless leggings that they have. I actually think you could just size down if you're in between and I wish I got these at a size small. Otherwise I would say it's true to size. It's very flexible, very stretchy. Here I got a Squatchy sticker. It's a brand on Etsy that sells stickers, but kind of funny that I'm going to use it for a squat test because squat Chi, squatchy. I know it's Sasquatch, but you know what I mean? But <laughs> I'm gonna use this, put it here, and then show you. Again, I truly feel like it's extremely see-through, so if it's too see-through, I will not include that clip. We shall see. Yeah, see, just standing up, I can see the sticker. Definitely 100% not squat proof. I don't even need to bend to know that. <laughs> While I have y'all on this angle, I can kind of show you more of the legging. Here, you can see the glutes. I will say this is such a thin, thin, thin material that any cellulite or dimples, dents, anything will be shown. Yeah, for me, I am someone who kind of needs a little bit more shaping and structure with my leggings for glute aesthetics because I do have hip dips and some cellulite so a legging like this is just gonna highlight anything like that which honestly sometimes I rock it like it's it's you know it's the human body it's totally fine but if you are someone who doesn't want to show things like that steer clear of these leggings. Of course the color doesn't help it's so light but I can just tell from feeling how thin this fabric is and the limited structure to these leggings that even if you went darker you would still kind of have those issues unless of course you had like a black legging. Here is what they look like full length. I at five foot eight so these are tall girl friendly because they have so much vertical stretch all in all i think this is a cute aesthetic but i just don't think it'll be something i typically wear to the gym except for the top i think this will be really good for back day let's hope the lilac set does this a little bit better i'll be right back okay i'm still putting on the lilac set but just a moment for this combination it's giving daphne it's giving scooby-doo just wanted to show that like that's an option mix matching the colors okay anyway let me put those leggings on. <laughs> All right, cuties, we got that lilac set on here. Again, it's just giving like that girl, you know what I mean? Like it's cute. I'm I'm impressed. Let's say these are their new knockout seamless leggings that they semi recently launched. And honestly, these are the ones I was the most excited to try. And then for the top, it's the Wander Seamless Bra. And of course, these are both in the color lilac and they're both in the size medium. Let's get into the Wander Seamless Bra. So right off the bat, this is the same size as the last bra, but I actually like this bra so much more. I don't know, I find it more flattering and it just feels more comfortable. And there's a little bit more coverage too. You can see the front, it's like pretty standard. We do have the cut pads in. This is also a ribbing material, just like the last bra. I did size up to a medium for my chest size. And I will say there is a lot of stretch here, but it still feels pretty good around my rib cage. For the back, this is the main event. Talk about another back moment. I really love the spine feature. I just think it's so cute. And there is so much space here for your lats. It doesn't dig in whatsoever. So it feels really comfortable and I actually could wear this all day and have no issues. Even with these thin straps, I, I don't know, they're just stretchy, like they're they're fine. I can imagine they might be uncomfortable if you size down. So I'd recommend like sizing up if you're in between with this bra, but otherwise just stick to your true size. 100% this bra is a win for me. Now let's go into these leggings. So these leggings, are honestly just like their curved leggings. The only difference is their waistband. Same material and everything that I went into that review. I did get a medium with these leggings, uh, with both the leggings this time around because of my experience with like the curb and the contour leggings that are exactly the same structure. When I had a size small, the midsection was really tight and uncomfortable. So I decided to size up this time around and I will say like <laughs> a medium is quite a size up from the small and this is a little bit too big for my comfort. I could make it work you know this 
type of material really hugs you. It's not like the worst. I do wish I had decided to go with my size down rather than my size up. The band is actually very, very stretchy. So I wonder if Navigation just kind of like took some feedback on their band being really tight. It's possible they adjusted it. Next time I buy from Navigation, I'm definitely just gonna opt for a small because this one just is extremely, extremely stretchy and there's like extra fabric and pulling up these leggings were a challenge because there was too much fabric. It, it, it was a whole thing, okay? Here we have the back, do that 180. So like I said, similar to that contour sleeveless legging, you have those smileys underneath. And again, the fabric's exactly the same as those leggings. The only difference is this band, which is a darker color and it kind of does a little dip down. I do heavily prefer these leggings over the last leggings I tried. I just wish I had sized down to the small that I normally get in their leggings. So if you're in between, size on down. Also, I believe these leggings will be a little bit more squat proof than the last. The lilac color is a little bit darker. So we'll go ahead to do a squat test with that squatchy sticker of mine. All right, girly, so this is kind of what these leggings fully look like. Here is the sticker. We'll go ahead and get that down here. And right off the rip, I'm not seeing the sticker while standing. So let's go ahead and do a little squat test. So when squatting, we could definitely see that sticker just a little bit more. It is more squat proof than the pistachio leggings and I would consider this safe for leg day as long as you wear nude underwear underneath. Unfortunately, because these mediums are a little too big for me, the smileys keep like dragging down and they don't stick where they're supposed to like the smalls do. Here is what the leggings look like full length, tall girl friendly. But otherwise, at least upon first impressions, haven't taken them to the gym. I do really like these leggings. I just wish I had sized down. That's really my only complaint. Now I did get the lilac color in another sports bra. So let me just throw that on real quick with these leggings so you can see what that option looks like. Alrighty, lilac girlies. So here is that same lilac color in the Invincible Seamless Sports Bra. This may look familiar to you. I actually reviewed this in my full navigation brand review and try on hauls. Definitely check out that official navigation video for a more in-depth review. I bought it because I love this sports bra. I love this color. So it was an obvious choice, you could say. Quick overview, this sports bra definitely has like the most coverage out of the three options I've shown in this try on haul. Perfect, perfect, perfect for upper body days. Got this in a size medium as per usual with my sports bras due to my chest size and my upper back. Just thought this would be a cute option to pair with these leggings as well. And again, who doesn't love purple, you know? Now I'm gonna put on those gray digital seamless leggings to pair with the sports bras. We'll see if the last pair of leggings is a hit or a miss. So I think we saved the best legging for last. I guess three is the lucky number because these leggings are gorge. I'm obsessed. So these are the digital seamless gray leggings. I actually did get these in a size small because I noticed these leggings have a decent amount of polyester in them, which means they're usually stretchier. I was so drawn to the pattern here. So come and check it out. It is a digital pattern. You just have different random specs and you can see even the navigation logo here is actually camouflaged into the print which is awesome my only i guess gripe with these leggings is the waistband actually a shorter waistband whenever like you start like moving around bending doing your activity things i don't know it actually starts like shimmering down and eventually you can see my belly button i will also say my torso is like a standard size torso it's not really considered shorter or longer than the average so if you are someone who prefers like really high-waisted leggings or if you're someone who's a really long torso these are gonna be a little bit shorter for you yes. keep that in mind i'm rolling with it i'm trying to embrace like the lower rise i know that's like more trendy these days here's what it looks like in the back and we'll do a little 180 little spin these in the back are actually so fire and so cute. Let me actually grab you guys a little bit closer. Here is more what it looks like. I feel like the pattern is just really good at helping conceal cellulite. Of course, this is also a darker color, so that helps as well. And again, I do have hip dips, but with patterned leggings, they just help to kind of smooth that out. It's really more just like a concealing kind of vibe. It's very cute. Definitely recommend. Let's try it like a little squat test. Here's that handy sticker. This is almost like an ad for the sticker company. I promise it's not. So it's actually right here and right off the bat, you cannot see it while standing. So that's a good sign. Let's try squatting and see what we think.
So for me, I could only see this bright red part of the sticker, but nothing else. I would consider this safe for light days. Yeah, quite frankly, I am obsessed with these digital seamless leggings. I think I'm gonna give navigation more of my money and buy this in other colors, TBH. This one's quite a win for me. That will conclude this try on haul for navigation and some of their most recent pieces. I hope it was helpful for you. I know it wasn't like as in depth as my normal try on haul reviews, but this is really just a fun try on haul period. So of course I'm not affiliated with navigation. This was just an authentic try on haul from a customer's point of view. But if you like any of these pieces, feel free to check out navigation and their website. If you liked the video, feel free to hit that like button, especially if you're a girly, please like and subscribe because we make these videos for you. And sometimes these videos find creepy men online and we don't want that. So like this video, push this to the right audience. And I would really, really love and appreciate that. Thanks for having a girl's back. Of course, thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed the more casual vibe. Because sometimes it's just fun to be less structured and just enjoy and take YouTube a little less serious. Of course, always great to touch base with you guys. So if you have any comments or questions, feel free to leave those down below. Other than that, I will see you guys in the next video. Bye!